What's going on guys, it's Blink. Today I'm going to show you a new glitch which I found about two weeks ago. This will let you merge any skate park item without deleting your patch. So you can actually do this one on Xbox One. What you want to do is go to a new skate park. So I'm just using PCU as this example. Once you're in your skate park, you want to go to skate parks and then my parks. And then you need to select a park which has DLC, which you've not got installed. You'll get this menu come up, just press no on that. And now you can start designing your park. So just for this example, I'll make a really easy park. I'm just going to place two quarter pipes and five scaffolding items. So once you're happy with your park layout, you're now ready to merge it. So literally it's as simple as going to any public map. It can be industrial estate, downtown, skate school. I'm just going to use skate school as an example because the PCU floor is the exact same height as the skate school. So yeah, once you've done this merge, uh, you can go ahead, film your clips, do whatever you want to do. If your items aren't quite in the right place, you can go back and edit them. You will notice that in the skate park, we actually placed five scaffolds down, but there are only four here. And that is because the last action that you do in a skate park or the last item that you place will not merge. So here I placed two ramps and a pad. <clears throat> now if I try to merge this, only the pad on the left, sorry, only the ramp on the left and the pad would merge. This right one wouldn't. So if I wanted all three of them to merge over, you would just have to place a fourth item. So the last item you place or the last action you do won't be saved basically. So if I wanted to make all of these items brown, only the first two would be brown when I merge the park. This one would still be gray. If I wanted this one to be brown as well, just change the color to something else. And because that's the last thing we did, it would now be brown. So now I'm gonna show you how you can merge an entire skate park rather than making a brand new park every time you want to do this. And all you wanna do is go to the park that you want to merge and then repeat the glitch. So I'm gonna try to load a park which I've not got the DLC for, close the menu. Now you want to press select and go into color and you wanna pick any random color, it doesn't matter which one. And you want to press square to apply to all. It will say, do you, are you sure you want to apply the color to all objects in the park? Press yes. And now you want to press undo. And now you want to go back into color and apply the color to every item in the park again. And then you are pretty much done. Um, applying color is the only thing in the skate park editor which affects every single item other than picking it up and placing it back down which would take a long time. So because the last thing we did was change the color to pink that will be forgotten about and as you can see all the items are back to their original color. So here we are We've now got my entire skate park merged with the skate school. Um, if you do this at the industrial estate, your items will spawn around the mountain and the pier where you play a game of skate. If you do this in the uh, university district, none of your items will really be accessible. They'll be under the floor near where you play campus skate. And downtown, I can't remember where they spawn to be honest. So you can go online, so I'm now online in the skate school and all my items are here. But this is not really an online glitch because when my friend joins, as you can see, the server disconnects. If you have less items, your friend will be able to see the items. But as soon as they step on the items, the lobby will always disconnect. Anyway, I hope you enjoy this glitch and I'll see you in the next one.